All right, guys, I wanted to show you um, a couple of screwdrivers that I've got that uh, some of my favorites that, and a, and a few interesting combinations and also some new products. Um, this is all gonna be from Klein. Uh, kind of the first one to starting out, the, uh, the one I got initially is the Klein 32303, the 14-in-1 adjustable. So with this, you have a length adjustable shaft. Uh, you can also take this out and put it in an impact driver. Uh, and obviously you have quarter inch magnetic bit holder and then storage for 12 bits in the back, uh, plus one in here, plus the nut driver. And that makes it the 14 in one. Um, but about a year ago, I found a video from uh, Joey Morgan at Morgan's Maintenance on the super screwdriver. And what that entails is getting yourself one of these 14 in one, take this out and get a seven in one flip socket set and stick it in. And now you have all 12 bits in here uh, plus a bit in the carrier because this pops out uh, so you can use it as a bit holder. Let me stick it out of here just like that. Plus quarter inch hex. You can flip it around. There's 5 16 and then 11 32nd, 3 8 uh, 7 16 and half all up in here. Um, the way you get to these bits is you pull it out, you slide them off the back and they just go on like so and of course you still keep your adjustable length if you pull the sockets off so you can shorten up your driver if you need to uh, and this uh, he affectionately coined the super screwdriver uh, and i thought it would be extremely useful uh, in my line of work to have a type of singular screwdriver with all of the bits and all of these nut drivers on one screwdriver uh, to just have one, you know, one screwdriver I can sl slip in my pocket, uh, take into a crawl space, up into an access in an attic or underneath uh, a house or building somewhere and not really have to worry about do I have the right uh, driver for whatever fasteners I come across. Um, so I built this a little less than a year ago. Uh, I've been using it ever since. I absolutely love this thing. Um, I tend to just pull this out of my bag and go to this. Uh, I have pretty much every dedicated screwdriver and nut driver I need in my bag for everything I do, but I end up grabbing this guy, especially in commercial and industrial jobs um where there's there can be a lot of different types of fasteners uh in different places so this uh this has worked out really well for me uh it kind of led me to another little discovery uh, i also found klein makes an eight and one stubby adjustable again you've got the quarter inch bit holder which is also a quarter inch nut driver uh, this is adjustable length as well even though it's a little bit less uh, a little bit shorter difference between the length adjustments obviously because it's a stubby same uh, same impact capability but you can also take the shorter quarter five sixteenths flip socket and stick it in there and now you have essentially a super stubby so those are the two companions. Uh, again, I use I definitely use this one more than this guy. Um, but when I get need to get into a tight space, um, really like this. I normally don't. I really don't have any dedicated stubby screwdrivers uh, because I don't run into a whole lot of uh, instances where I would need a stubby. Um, so having all of basically a multi-bit stubby screwdriver with quarter and five sixteenths at the very least uh 
works fine. Plus, if I need any of the bigger ones, uh, bigger sizes in the stubby length, I can just pull one off of here, slip it up here, and it's all good. So we have those two. Uh, now, recently, Klein has moved, uh, is starting to move out of Home Depot, as far as I know, and moving into Lowe's. Uh, I, I don't have a Home Depot near me. The closest Home Depot is like an hour and a half away from me, but I have two Lowe's where I live. And I went in there to go check out what Klein stuff they brought in so far and found this guy. This is the 32303HD. Uh, now, you can get your super screwdriver all in one and not have to buy two separate pieces. This, I believe the, the 14 in one is typically about 25 bucks, uh, sometimes $30, and then this is about $20. So you're looking about 45 to $50 to make this. And then this is right at $39.99 or $40 at Lowe's the way it comes. So you save a little bit of money to just go ahead and get the setup as it comes. Um, still, you know, the same, uh, same storage in the back. They've actually done some updates to this and I'll show that in a second. But, you know, same flip sockets. Um, and it is labeled as the 20, uh, 20 in one adjustable impact. Um, so the, uh, kind of some updates that they've done between the old 32303 and the new is a little bit better made carousel. I think i actually, you can kind of see it right here. I didn't even intend to do that. Uh, the bits like to slide around, uh, in this guy. Um, I've had issues with that where I'll pop the carousel open and I've, I've had a couple of bits fall out on me. Um, plus there's a little plate down in there that's not, it's a separate piece from the carousel and I've actually had it pop down uh, and almost lost some bits down in the handle, but um, it seems like they have fixed that with this. The plate down there is like the same, is part of the whole carousel, so it's not going to fall off. Plus they've added this little divider to keep uh, the bits from kind of sliding around. Um, they've also changed the collar. They've gone with kind of a flatter black collar now. Um, I can't really, I, it feels almost like there's a little bit less play in it. Uh, that may just be because it's newer um, and I've had this, you know, I've used this a lot and I really haven't used this much yet. Um, but yeah, that's another change. And then I know as far as between this seven and one and the new flip sockets that come on this, uh, they have updated the magnets. Uh, one complaint that everybody's had about these flip sockets has been that the magnets fall out. I haven't had that issue, but it seems like on the new one, um, they've added a, if I can get to the focus, they put a little bit smaller magnet with like a retaining ring or a cert clip or something. Uh, to hold it in there a little bit better. So, you know, small updates, small improvements. Um, one other thing is when you look at this on Lowe's website, and I was super excited when I saw this, um, I was going to go pick one up, was that uh, instead of coming with this flip socket set, it's pictured with this flip socket set. Um, and I was a little bit disappointed when I showed up at Lowe's and it came with this flip socket set and not this one. They do have this available separately. This is the 32303, or sorry, 32933G flip socket set. Uh, comes with a torque, uh, T25 Torx as well uh, with this, but um, you see they've deleted the 11 30 seconds and added a 9 16 instead i really wanted that uh to come with it because i come across nine uh, nine sixteenths all the time i have never come across an 11 30 seconds hex so having a another usable socket on this set would be great for me um so i even though i was disappointed ended up picking it up anyways so my 
chosen configuration for this is going to be just like that. Uh, so I have the 9 sixteenths. Um, and they've done a couple of updates with this as well. It's the same updated magnet on the shaft. Uh, you can see the sockets are kind of a little bit different shape. Um, they're more stepped than uh, have like a taper to them. So yeah, just some small updates. Uh, again, now I have, I, I love this thing so much that now I have one new one to put in the bag and uh, one to kind of keep around the house or even in the truck um, if I just need a spare. But yeah, just wanted to show those to y'all. If y'all haven't seen the super screwdriver yet, um, also show you the super stubby because I haven't really seen people talk about this and also showcase uh, that you can now just buy the whole setup at Lowe's just like that. Um, and they also have this new flip socket set available, even though I'm kind of pissed that it doesn't come already with the screwdriver. So anyway, that's pretty much it. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Enjoy.